Imagine you just moved into a new place. You've unpacked your belongings, cleaned up, and now you're ready to settle in. But there's one crucial thing missing, a reliable phone system. That's where UMA comes in. It's a simple, affordable way to get a landline without the hassle of traditional phone service. So you've got your UMA device. Now what? Don't worry, I've got you covered. In this video, we'll walk you through the step-by-step -step process of setting up your UMA for the first time. Step 1. Unboxing and Setup Let's start by taking your UMA device out of the box. You should find the base station, the phone adapter, if applicable, and the power cord. First, connect the power cord to the base station and then plug it into a wall outlet. Next, if you're using a traditional landline phone, connect the phone adapter to the base station and then plug your phone into the adapter. Step 2. Installing the UMA app now it's time to download the UMA app. You can find it on the Apple App Store or Google Play Store. Once you've downloaded and installed the app, open it and tap on Create a New Account. Step 3. Creating an account. Follow the on-screen instructions to create your UMA account. You'll need to provide your name, email address, and phone number. Once you've created your account, you'll be prompted to enter your UMA device's serial number. This can be found on the bottom of the base station. Step 4. Activating your UMA device. After entering your serial number, UMA will activate your device. This process may take a few minutes. Once your device is activated, you'll be able to use it to make and receive calls. Step 5. Setting up your phone numbers. If you've purchased a new UMA phone number, you can start using it immediately. However, if you're porting your existing number to UMA, it may take a few days for the port to complete. During this time, you can use your temporary UMA number. Step 6. Customizing your UMA settings. Now that your UMA device is set up, you can customize your settings to suit your needs. This includes things like setting up caller ID, voicemail, and call forwarding. You can access these settings through the UMA app. Step 7. Testing your UMA device. Finally, it's time to test your UMA device. Make a call to a friend or family member to ensure that everything is working properly. You can also have someone call you to test your incoming calls. And that's it. You've successfully set up your UMA device. With UMA, you can enjoy crystal clear voice quality, reliable service, and a host of features that make it a great alternative to traditional landline service. So what are you waiting for? Start enjoying the benefits of UMA today. With that said, Thanks for watching and until next time.